to Atlanta. I got just a little gig that I'll help y'all out. All you have to do is sit down for a little chat. Felicia heard I wanted to do a reality show and talk about our problems. Yo, she would flip. Man, Quincy would feel some type of way if I told you about this. Caleb Davis and I'm Ronnie Simpson and we are the creators of the Tough Love web series. University of California, Riverside, mm. and that's where I asked her to be my girlfriend. Okay. And um, from there, I went to grad school, film school in London, and she was finishing up her senior year in California, and she decided to apply to the new school here in, uh, here in New York. Mm -hmm. So when I was finishing up film school in the UK, she was like, ah, oh, come over here and you know, let's, let's move to New York. So I was like, of course. The creative process for Tough Love, we wanted to really dive back into that black film essence, like brown sugar, love and basketball, you know, best man. When it came to uh, developing the characters, yes, it did come a lot from um, different people we know, uh, friends. Like our studio in Manhattan is the place where a lot of friends come and talk about their relationship problems and we just hang out. and. There's a lot of drama going on with millennials. And then I have some friends that are like, they'll tell me stories now and they're like, don't write this way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or like, they want to make sure, I want to make sure sometimes when I'm writing that I don't want to put someone's exact story out there either. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I just take pieces. You know, we have a friend um, who was on a date and she accused, uh, she accused the, the guy of taking her phone. My phone's missing. Did you take it to the bathroom? No, I left it here. Season two, we filmed majority here in Brooklyn mm -hmm. um, because what we did, we actually made sure to rent out like two main spots so that we can have new interior design for our characters. So if you see Jackson's place where Quincy is living with them, that's all Brooklyn. Um, that was that was Crown Heights. Mm -hmm. And then if you see uh, the ladies, they have a you know a whole new apartment in season two. That's uh, that's Crown Heights as well. Mm -hmm. So we we filmed like the meat of season two here in Brooklyn. True. And um, you know we will even go to a lot of different restaurants and to promote them as well when once our ep episodes are released. Yeah, and it was a lot of people in Brooklyn. A lot of Brooklyn business owners were really helpful as far as just letting us use their space. They are actually excited. They were watching us shoot the scenes and stuff yeah. like that. Um, I did not think uh, for a long time that writing uh, for film or TV was for me because I was like, I just want to focus on real stuff. I realized that I can just put real stuff into my scripts. Uh, so these are focused on real life issues, uh, real life people, based on true events. The male perspective of tough love, 25% um, of our audience is, uh, is male, by the way. 75% is, uh, is, is ladies. I wanted to uh, boost up those numbers. I wanted to make like 50-50. And my, my auntie, she said, uh, she's a therapist, and she said that black men need content like this. Like if you see yourself on screen and you understand why this is happening, maybe it could change a pattern in the future. Is there someone you're refusing to forgive because they hurt you in the past? Damn. Getting straight into it, I see, huh? Some advice that I'll give to uh, up and coming filmmakers, uh, creators coming into the industry is just create, you know, every day. And I think just Tough Love itself is a, a filmmaker's mixtape because we get the opportunity to deal with all the up and coming talent right now. Like, you know, you might not know the, the actors and you might not know the musicians and the composers that you see in Tough Love today, but five to 10 years, or five to 10 years, shoot, might be months 
but down the line you're gonna see that these people that we worked with this is a platform for them to at least create to express so just me as a filmmaker a producer or, you know arranging this I just want to continue to build relationships continue to have a creative platform with you know creators here in New York creators that come in from other cities people all around the world